Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to my channel again as I embark in this journey to create a YouTube channel and share some of my experiences in amateur radio and other technologies, including cybersecurity, uh, etc. Um, I wanted to shoot this quick video today. Uh, I've had a lot of requests for this. I've made many contacts on the air and I uh, wanted to show something here, uh, show you what I'm working here today. I'm working with the TYT 390 Plus. This is the latest from TYT. And uh, just wanted to show here, uh, for the record, uh, that indeed it is a 390 plus with GPS. This is the latest, the latest and greatest. So uh, a lot of question around this radio. Main question is, what software? what firmware can run on this. And uh, I'll just show you. So yeah, this is the TYT390 Plus running an open GD77. Everything works on this radio. I have not tested the encryption, but other than that, pretty much everything works. So uh, the GPS works, everything works. And I'll show you what firmware I'm running. Currently listening to BM Worldwide. So just wanted to show that. And uh, I absolutely love this radio. I am not a huge TYT fan. I stick to the big three, big four name brand. And uh, took a shot in the dark with this radio. This radio is absolutely overly built. It is incredible. This is a commercial grade radio here. None of these buttons have any play. It's got a very positive feel to everything. Uh, doesn't feel cheap at all like the 1701 Baofeng DMR radio. Uh, everything is great here. Uh, I'm running the 771 Nagoya antenna. It's my favorite antenna of all times. And uh, it's absolutely great. Now, I want to talk a little bit about the speaker in this radio and the analog receive and transmit. In today's age of digital radios, analog is an afterthought. At least I think so. Uh, a perfect example of that is uh, some of the Yezu, the newer digital Yezu radios, they don't sound very well on analog. If any of you are familiar with the FT60, the Fox Tango 60 from Yesu, and the incredible speaker that had in it, this is extremely close. This is the only radio that I've heard at any price range that has that quality of, of a speaker in inside of it. So uh, just wanted to share that as well. I think for the money, this is very hard to beat. Very, very hard to beat. I needed a third DMR radio. And uh, I took a sh shot in the dark with this radio, and I'm absolutely blown away. Uh, again, it's running GD77, open GD77. And let's go ahead and uh, show you again the firmware. If you attempt to put this firmware on the radio and you break the radio, I do, you know, it's on you. Uh, I, I, I took a chance doing it and it worked out. <clears throat> I used a donor, a 9600 donor and loaded a, a 380 firmware on there and it worked like a charm. I will uh, shoot another video with the GPS functions um, in the dark outside. Uh, but uh, yeah, just wanted to shoot a quick video and uh, get it out there. This is the TYT390+. Plus. On Open GD 77. This is Whiskey 4 Kilo Whiskey Sugar. Clear. Please, if you like the content that you find on my channel, <clears throat> subscribe, uh, leave comments, and I will try to shoot a video for you. Any special requests, I will try to get to it. And uh, yeah, we will really appreciate you subscribing to my channel. Thank you so much. 73 from Key West. W4KWS clear.